Hey, what's up guys? This is Team Hard Life Captain Albert Sarkuche, and I'm going to be doing the next models of our Go Fish camera arsenal. We got to get them set up because we got a fishing trip that we got to attend, and um, yeah, it's been a while since I've done some fishing, so yes. Got a lot of stress on my mind It's a nice day to go Yeah, I got a line I'm a caller The whole team All right guys, I made a mistake here. I connected this short end and that was supposed to be for my hook end, so I'm gonna have to cut it off and start again. And yeah, oh, great. I'm glad I didn't heat shrink it because then I would have wasted some heat shrink there. A little bit of sleeves of mono is better than wasting the, the higher end items, so gotta start again. three-way then I need my long section and that's so that way 
the GoFish camera will be further away from the weight and doesn't get tangled up on it, especially when I'm using surf weights. Insert my heat shrinks back on. I need a long and a short. And a sleeve and back to the GoFish camera. I'm going to assemble it all before I start crimping anything just to make sure I don't miss anything. I think I should have did that first and I didn't. All right, guys, the other thing that crossed my mind was, all right, I'm deep dropping. Do I really need the floats on there? Ah, I wish I had more cameras. I really do, but I don't. So for this deep drop, I'm not going to attach the floats onto the leader. Because um, I definitely don't want it sitting horizontal in the water column, which will be cool that way. But at the same time, too, what if all the fish are underneath me? I won't know. <laughs> so I'm kind of stuck between a rock and a hard place you know so uh, and I want to do one with floats and one without but I'm already doing another test with and without the heat shrink right here on the circle hook so uh, troubleshooting it's not for the faint of heart and it will eat you alive if you don't have everything but uh yeah <clears throat> so yeah I'll keep going
All right, guys, so there they are. Like I said, I've got one with the circle hook that is heat shrinked in place, and then I got one that's not heat shrinked in place. And we're gonna go deep dropping for snapper and see if that makes a difference or not. So, uh, yep. I think I'm gonna straighten this one out a little bit because, I don't know, I mean, like I said, I really don't know how this is gonna react. I think bait's a little buoyant, but at the same time, it could track it down. But uh, we'll see. So, yeah, there they are. Next, next generations of the Go Fish cams. Yep, yeah, there's a close up. Set up, ready to rock and roll. We'll see what happens. Go Fish cam. Boom. Also, too. Be sure to pick them up here at Hard Lights Bait and Tackle or give us a call and we can get them shipped out to you very quickly. They've also dropped in price too. They have dropped down dramatically. Give us a call if y'all are interested. We'll keep you posted.